Hi, my name's Al, and I have a gambling problem. I like to bet on the Buffalo Bills. They're my team. I like them as favorites, underdogs, on the road, at home. I don't care. I also like to bet on other games. I spend three hours watching a game, but it seems about five minutes analyzing it beforehand. You can even call it that. I look at the standings, listen to the experts, talk to my buddies, guess my results. I thought there might be a better way, at least some way to give myself an edge. I'm a software designer, and it occurred to me that I might try to design and build a spread analyzer program using the principles of genetic algorithms. These algorithms would create and evolve artificial neural networks which would attempt to predict game results. This is the interface I came up with. It looks complicated, maybe sounds complicated, but it's simple. I'm smart, not bright. I need something simple. The system is basically a laboratory where you create and test formulas or schemes. These schemes compare vital team statistics and the relative importance to the results of games. This is the main interface. It's divided up into a number of sections. This section shows information about the current game being analyzed, calculated scores and spreads. This is the system messages window displays information about what you and the software have been up to. Control buttons let you manage the system, creating and saving schemes, loading games, updating the latest statistics, and examining other vital information. Adjustable track bars allow you to set weightings for various team statistics. Teams holding an advantage in a statistic can be given anywhere from 0 to 7 points. Here's how the system works. The basic idea is that you create a scheme or a formula based on statistics from previously played games. You then apply this formula to future games. If your formula is sound, Hopefully it will assist you in predicting the spreads for these future games. Step 1. Create a scheme. Start up the product and click on the Create Scheme button. A menu is displayed containing a variety of offensive, defensive, and special team statistics. Using your football knowledge, Click on the various statistics you feel are most important in determining the outcome of a game. Click OK when you're satisfied. Each menu item you selected creates a track bar representing that statistic. Each track bar can be adjusted from anywhere from 0 to 7 points. If you like, you can allow the system to recommend scheme statistics. This will be explained in further detail later on in the video. Evolve or fine-tune your scheme using genetic algorithms and your own knowledge and intuition. First, load any completed game. Any game will do. Once you've loaded the game, the system will display information about that game, as well as calculated scores. The scores are calculated based on points scored for and against by both teams and your selections of the important statistics and their weightings. The points you set for each statistic will be automatically awarded to the team with an advantage in that statistical category. The idea is to try to match as close as possible the calculated spread with the actual spread of the game. As well as manually adjusting the track bars, you can run a genetic algorithm which will automatically adjust these track bars for you. 
The system will try to find a scheme which accurately predicts the score of the game. Click on the Run Genetic Algorithm button to fire this up. The system will automatically adjust the statistical weightings and evaluate the predicted scores. The interface will flash when a better scheme has been found. While this is happening, click on the Mutate and Crossover buttons to randomly alter the trackbar settings or to swap in a statistic that was not previously selected. The message window keeps you informed of the various system activities. After a time, the system will have found the best scheme it could have possibly found. This will essentially cause it to start spinning its tires. When you feel this has happened, press the Stop button. All we've really done at this point is create a scheme that works on a single game. Click on the Test This Scheme on Completed Games button. The system will test your scheme against all of the completed games it has on file. The system message window will inform you the percentage of times your scheme would have predicted a winning wager against the spread. Anything less than 55% is not worth hanging on to. But if you do find a successful scheme, you can save it to your hard disk. You can save as many schemes as you like. These can be compared in future experiments to determine which ones are superior. It's best to choose a descriptive name for your scheme. Click on the Save button when you're done. Finally, the whole point of this business. Use your scheme to see if it can't give you the correct advice in wagering against the spread on a future game. At this point, you can use the scheme you've just created or load a previously saved scheme. Now click on the Load Game button and load a future game. The system will calculate and display its prediction based on your scheme. The predicted score appears here, and a title bar makes a recommendation as to whether you should bet on the home team or the away team. If you click on the Predict button, the Messages window will display the system's recommendation. A number of other features are available in order to assist you with your analysis. Download the latest game information and statistics over the Internet. Check out detailed team statistics. Look at the league standings. Or check on the home city weather. Need to do some quick calculations? Type your arithmetic expressions of arbitrary complexity into the input box. Press enter and these will be evaluated and the results will be shown in the system messages window. Should you become aware of some issue which may impact a team's performance in a game, such as an injury to a key player, inclement weather, or perhaps some special motivation, you may utilize the motivation and x-factor track bars. Using either one of these bars allows you to adjust the score up to 14 points for one team or the other. You can run experiments on historical game information by clicking on one or more of these three buttons. Test the accuracy and modify your schemes based on the information contained in hundreds of previously played games. As was mentioned earlier in this video, you can allow the system to plow through historic contests and determine which statistics most often favored teams winning against the spreads. You can allow this process to run through completion or stop it at any time. The system reports on the top 10 statistics common to winning teams and creates track bars for these stats. You'll find other tools which will help you manage your session in the relaxation box in the bottom right corner of the interface. For example, get inline help 
or link to useful football related websites from here. Note the prominent exit key. Analyzing football contests for the purpose of wagering can be a very tedious and sometimes stressful business. Take a break by honing and testing your intuitive skills using an implementation of the standard Jenner ESP test. Those are the highlights. Thank you very much for viewing this demonstration of the EDGE NFL Spread Analyzer program. A few final comments, if I may. In case it isn't blindingly obvious, let me make the point that this is not a science. What I've tried to do is craft an application which hopefully will give someone like myself, a casual better, a slight advantage in the world of sports betting. I realize that using sophisticated programming techniques applied to gambling on American football games may not be the loftiest of human efforts. I'm just trying to work in familiar territory. Perhaps future incarnations of this system and its interface may someday be applied to nobler human endeavors. Maybe basketball or even soccer. Anyway, if you have the time or inclination, please feel free to download and try my beta test version of this system. I will be continuing to improve this system as time goes by. Eventually I hope to add some new features such as the ability to examine a variety of seasonal trends, streaks and various threshold situations. Please feel free to send me any comments, ideas or suggestions that you may have regarding this system. You may download a no-charge prototype of the Edge from the product section of my website www.cerebrasoftware.com you can contact me by email at info at cerebrosoftware.com or join the Google group The Edge NFL Spread Analyzer at googlegroups.com. Again, thanks for watching. Good luck to you, and of course, go Bills!